is that? Um, you can do this with us. Be easier, right? Grab a human. So, commence, right? Une bonne façon de entraîner. So, if you want to, you want to train this. What you do is you can practice. You create serré, serré, serré for quelques seconds, right? Puis tu lâches un peu. Mais quand tu lâches, right? It goes tight, tight, tight. But then if you release, tu viens pas mou. Tu donnes juste un espace. So if you squeeze, si faut que passer, right? That's tight. Maybe I can't stay there and work slowly without passing out. Then he releases just a bit, mais il reste serré. He's tight, he's still strong. So he gives me a centimeter, but my color doesn't really come back. I don't really have color perception at this point either. <laughs> right? So sometimes it's so tight, you're like this. I cannot even rotate up to the camera, and this is not helping. Ah, I see it's going to be too tight. So this is the first thing I want to do. Je vais placer mon main. See, my hand's going to come inside. Je vais tirer, puis l'autre main, ça peut pousser. So I'm going to go pull, push, and I just need to make space to be able to turn my chin inside like this, a little bit. That's going to make a big difference. If I stay under, he's going to choke. Here he's on my artery. So, si fort que possible, arrête pas. So I'm going to let him start to choke me a little bit. See what happens, right? So I go, I still do the same. And then I keep sagging back like this. And this is better for me now, because now my chin is stopping it, or I can get my cheek in there a little bit like this. That's what I want. And then laying it away, far hand is going to grab in here, and you can even grab like that. So now that starts to tire him. Sometimes I'll just let the younger, bigger guys uh, get tired a little bit before I move. Because if I'm not trying, and then I'll do things like this. I pretend like I'm losing energy on his leg. It's good for their ego. They go, oh, yeah, I got it. But they don't really have. So what I've got now is my head is no longer here. <laughs> Here is on the trick and on the false, false, false. So watch, push and pull, push and push. I'm wrestling, and all I've done in that little blend is I've pulled this and pushed this while pushing and pulling my body. And then I like to get here. Simple enough. So now I have brain power. Now I'm going to try to put my knee forward, and I'm going to pivot around my knee, and I want to slam my hip into his hip and reach for the far side of his butt. So I'm here like this, and I pull him out here. So then I'm in my side ride, and we can do all the stuff that we were doing mm -hmm. with our legs and everything else, right? Mm -hmm. Or I can go head and arm ride, reverse case of gatami. This is obi gatami belt lock. Get it under your rib, or your belly, whatever, it doesn't matter, and you can crank and control. Does that make sense? How I show different people? Yeah, I'm gonna see it, isn't it? So, smaller people, you get it, when you see older, uh, bigger people, you gotta be cruel to them. It's part of the Buddha, yeah? So squeeze your elbows tight. <laughs> yeah, get on the balls of your feet, take those knees off the ground, but you stay close to the ground. Put all your weight, sag and then drag in. That's what you want, so it's tight. It'd be funny if I passed out. Yeah. I hear right there, whoa, my ear just popped. I can hear the ocean or my aneurysm. <laughs> so now, squeeze as much as you want. I'm okay here. You can see my eyes are more lucid. I lose this, squeeze the elbows tight. Uh, like a Chinese finger cuff. And my one good artery. Well, that's right, I come back in. So that's what I want. So it's just that little point. That's what I want, right? And so now I, I get up on my toes. I'm ready to move. So, yeah. If I don't release this, his elbow rends, right? I control it. I like to go here. Reverse case. Lock it. Boom. Yeah? Even if it doesn't work. Sometimes you start to pass out and you're halfway through and you kind of stumble. Mm -hmm. So sometimes you're doing it, they foot away low. And you kind of work, and it kind of gets messy. Si tu peux pas l'avoir son son côté loin, if I can't get his hip, go to his leg and kick, and then climb around to the back. Just be careful about this. Mm -hmm. That's what tears the elbow. The medial ligament tears in that position. Then normally, I'd be, that's why I'd be heavy and sag on you to get oxygenation back to my brain, because mm -hmm. you'll get dizzy. Mm -hmm. But the best way to do it is to get a little bit of squeeze and feel yourself going. Yeah. So again, the first one that we did before was in that position, I was driving, pulling, and sitting out here. But now I see, whew, he's really got to tight, his elbows are tight, lock it up as hard as he can, left hand spider crawl across my back. Mm, it's tight, so I push and pull, I sit my chin, and I try to get that ear up as much as I can. If he falls, it's only because I'm doing it slowly. And I just, I get around. Hey, look, it's okay. <laughs> Does that make sense? Try slowly, it's okay to tap out. Say so you're Louis. Let's go. <laughs>